this is the second posting about the condenser that was leaking because it was aftermarket and i put the nylog around it to prove that it was leaking it has the new oem forward seals oem lines but aftermarket condenser that was machined wrong and let's turn off the vacuum and see what it looks like. if you remember on the other one it vacuum decayed and went all the way up to 29 inches of mercury we're now down at 240 so let me kill the vacuum let's see where it goes so you'll see this shoot up in a minute you can see it going up there there's a little delay there it goes it finally went up and then you see it's going to start the plateau in a minute probably plateau somewhere around 1400 microns because i only got uh, what do i got nine minutes i was almost at 10 minutes when i shut it off because i had to take it apart the technician had to redo this technician had to take this back off thank god he didn't have it all put back together because yeah he would be he just said it he'd be really pissed this is gonna screw up his day this is me being here fixing this leak is messing his day up holding him back because they decide to use an aftermarket condenser because the insurance company says that's what you're supposed to do i get to see this shit on a daily basis you guys in your shops you only get to see one or two every now and then it barely really happens to you but i go to many shops a day so for me this is just a another day of doing work and this is why I say this to the aftermarket condensers. So you can see where it's plateauing off here. It's starting to stop. So the rest of this is just outgassing and moisture in the system. And it's no longer going up to 4,000, 5,000, 6, 7, 8, like that, all the way up to 29 inches. Uh, because I used the nylock. And uh, it doesn't leak under pressure. You've seen I put it on, on my video on the last posting. I put it up to 150 and then later I put it to 200 PSI. It doesn't leak under pressure. It's only leaking under vacuum. And uh, so keep on using these aftermarket condensers. Keep on pissing off your employees because it wastes their time. And I just charge more for it. Not my problem. No money saved on using this aftermarket condenser. See you guys later.